what a day, what a day, what a day. I'm about to hurt some feelings on this one. I am about to hurt some feelings on this one. My goodness. So, just letting y'all know, I'm part of the ABN crowd, assholes by nature. <laughs> And that's a badge that I wear proudly. So, to get to my story, it's gonna be a little short little story. Been my rant. <laughs> so, I had a family member call me up and everything. He's like, yo, cuz, can I get a uh, $160? $160? Uh, uh, what's the 164 You know? And I mean, you need gas money and something like that, going back to work, going back to work and everything, and, and, and food and stuff. Oh no, man, I don't, I don't have a job right now. Hmm. Okay. So, what's it for? Oh, it's to take this chick out to the movies and dinner, and you know, get some, get get a get a couple drinks and um. And, uh, and some weed and go back to the house. Hmm. So you need $106 for me so you can take out this, this broad. Yeah, 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 man. Oh. Oh. Well, not trying to get in your business or whatever, but how come you don't have it? Oh, well, I ain't got a job right now. Okay. <laughs> so how long you been unemployed? You know, uh, last time I talked to you, really, about eight months ago, you had a job. Oh man, I got fired from that job. And well, about four months ago, I got fired again. I'm like, damn, what's going on? You get fired from all these jobs. Oh man, uh, you know, uh, I was set up and everything. Shit, damn, what happened? Oh man, they gave me a random drug test. You was set up, they gave you a random drug test. Really? Yeah, man, this chick that I was messing with, you know, snitched him. Oh, oh, okay. But it's a random drug test. And you got set up. So, did this chick that you was messing with smoke, you know, too? Or did whatever you did? Oh, man, all the thing I did was weed, you know, and I'm kind of addicted to it right now. And, you know, I need a little help and stuff, you know. Okay. Hold on, side note. Look at that sun shining on your boy. Looking like a gypsy in barrel right now. <laughs> Getting all golden and stuff. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, let me get back to the story. He was like, yeah, but um, got fired from two jobs. Both of them did drug tests on them. We failed it. And he basically needed $106 to take the shit out. I was like, uh, no. You know, I'm sorry. I, can, I don't have it to get to you. Oh man, come on man, I know you got it, you're a truck driver, you're making all that money and stuff. Uh, even still, I'm making, uh, yeah, I'm making all that money and stuff, but I got plans in the future. I don't got time to be wasting my money on you and not knowing when I'm going to get it back. Oh uh, man, you get it back in a couple months and stuff. Really? When you just told me that you are addicted to weed and people are setting you up. <laughs> this girl set you behind up and everything and the last job what happened okay what happened the last job let me oh well yeah it was, yeah i gotta you know i just told you man i got a uh, drug test and i failed it man i'm addicted to weed man i need your help to get me off weed man i don't know bro. I, 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 shit. i don't even know what to tell you right now i just know i don't got it for you man why are you being stingy uh, no, nah, I ain't being stingy. I'm using my damn head. That's my damn money you, you, you're messing around with. Hey, you want to blow on some chick? Yeah, out your goddamn mind. Shit, fuck that. Nah, he got mad with me and hung up and stuff. So, dudes, get your life together. You out here. <laughs> Staying at your mom's house, not doing nothing. Ain't got no goals. Don't not trying to look for a job but yeah you borrow money to take women out on during dates and stuff get your fucking life together yeah <laughs> my fact 
You know, women too, god damn it. Get your damn life together because these are the same damn women that will not go for the good dudes, that get stigmatized and move the dude in and get pregnant and now you stuck with this dude and don't know, uh, I mean, don't know how to get out of this situation and don't want to break up your happy home and everything. Well, quote unquote, happy home. Uh, you're out, you got a nine to five, you got a job and everything, but you want to build a nigga. My bad, I shouldn't have said the other day the word. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm getting beside myself. You want to build a dude, you know? You want to sit back and take care of that dude and, and everything, and then once, once you see them bills start rolling in after you get pregnant and stuff, now you're worried because you're going to be off a couple months and everything, and everything is still in your back. Why this dude at the house playing PlayStation or Xbox and stuff, and, um, and now you're worrying about bills and stuff. Man, come on. Man. There are plenty of fish out here in the POL. <laughs> See what I did there? <laughs> Corny. Anyway, there are plenty of fish out here. Shit, same thing with y'all dudes, man. If that girl's not acting right or whatever, why the hell you going up in that, that bra? Come on, man. Come on. I'm sorry. I ain't got time for all that BS. I got goals. It, yeah, it is about me, goddammit. Fuck that team of me. Like, uh, what's that dirt movie with RJ? With uh, Mark played RJ or whatever. The team of me, goddammit. Fuck that. Roscoe's Family Reunion. There we go. Roscoe's Family Reunion. Shit, I'm, a, I'm, I'm on a team of me. I'm sorry. I can't. I don't got handouts to give you. I got goals. I got stuff I need to do. Yo, people, use your head. Think more wisely. That's all I got to say. Because the crap that be coming at me on a daily basis <laughs> is ridiculous. It's re fucking ridiculous. No, I like ridiculous, but it's ridiculous. Shit. What the hell wrong with these damn people? What the hell wrong with these men and women out here? Grown ass damn adults. Still living with your mom house, at your mom house, which I ain't knocking. I'm not knocking whatsoever. Cause hell, I'm doing it right now because hell, I was paying twelve hundred dollars for uh, for uh, for an apartment that hell I was hardly at. So in order for me to cut down on my bills or whatever to stack up to save up for my goals, hey, sometimes you gotta make that sacrifice. But hell, I'm hardly there. Yeah, and then whenever I do want to come in town, hell, I don't got to stay there. I can go to a uh, motel and stay over there for a couple days. And, hey, I used to do it back in the day. So, hell, the bills I got right now, why I can't do it now? Which I am doing it now, and I'm at, I am succeeding. I am saving up. It's, uh, it's fucking ridiculous. Get yourself together. <laughs> Sorry to ramble on, sorry to rant like that, but it is what it is, you know. Motherfucker, we, we got some fucking nerves, man. Please forgive all the cussing. I know I, well, I don't think I said I was gonna stop cursing, but that's one of my things, you know. If you out here cursing and stuff like that, I mean, you ain't got a damn vocabulary. Sounds stupid as hell. Get yourself together. Peace. LS to the. I just said I was gonna start cursing. LS power, y'all. Holla.